now the last part of the game deals with scoring the individual who are playing the games now in order to give scoring part there will be a variable called as my variable so i will be just showing you over here this is variable part over here now when i click on the variable part over there you will be able to see make a variable my variable so i'm making a variable that means i have to click on make a variable i have to give a name to the variable so i'm giving the name as score for all sprite or for this sprite so i'm using only for this sprite and i'll click ok so my variable is ready now what i have to do remember we have to go to the sprite option the sprite option is this particular part when space bar click start sound equal to chirp repeat and so on so what i will do i will just drag one of the option that is from my variable itself or from variable itself from the variable you will be able to see change my variable so when i click on my variable there will be a drop down consisting of score rename variable and delete my variable so i have to click on score options now when i'm playing this game when i'm playing this game you will be able to see sorry i will be playing it again you are able to see when i'm starting the game it is showing us one itself that means the previous score is also there so how to delete the previous score this is the part where the bird should be down so what i'm doing over here my kids over here when green flag is clicked and go to x y set set variable again towards zero so my variable instead of my variable select score because score is the variable which we are using now you will be able to see that the score is zero again and it will be rising and when i stop or when the game is stopped when i'm playing it again it will again be zero so in this manner you are able to give your score and from here you are able to clear your score when the game hangs or when the game stops